In this video, we're going to go over the first steps for creating your story drawings. Let's get started. Start by thinking about what type of story you might like to tell. This could be a story that actually happened to you. It could also be a story that you've been told. It could be any kind of story. Just make sure that the content of the story, the story that you're telling, is an appropriate story for school. Our stories should have a beginning, middle, and end, just like our book, Blueberry Rapids. In Blueberry Rapids, the story begins with Ginu smuggling crayons to take to the bears at Blueberry Rapids. The middle of the story, Ginu burns his hand on the tea that they make. At the end of the story, Ginu gets his hand healed and he and his grandmother decide to make a kikiwan. Think about your story. Think about what the beginning, the middle, and the end will be. Here's an example that I made about a story where my sisters and I jumped in a creek. In my story, my sisters get home at the beginning, in the middle, we jump in the creek, and at the end, we track mud all over the house. So now we're going to draw the beginning of our story. In my story, it starts with my sisters arriving home. As you can see here, I've drawn my two sisters coming through the door to show that they have come home. This is your task for today. Get a piece of paper and some drawing supplies. You can use crayons, markers, a pencil, whatever you have, and draw the beginning of your story. Submit that picture to Seesaw. Have fun!